run, run. What's up, fam? Welcome to another adventure with Omar. Got my friend Dylan back there. Got Max, that's my son. We're gonna do our first ever one man hide and seek challenge. Now, a few videos ago, I visited a haunted clown motel, did a video there, and I was given this clown as a gift. In this clown motel, people donate their haunted clowns to the clown motel. This happens to be one that was disturbing a family in Massachusetts. I'm not sure the full story on it, but we're gonna find out tonight if it really truly is haunted. Now with this 3 a.m. challenge, we're gonna need some rice, we're gonna need a needle and thread, of course some scissors, and you're gonna need a stuffed animal or doll or whatever with limbs. You can see that Thomas here does have limbs. Last but not least, you're gonna need some salt and some water. There's my cup of water. I did bring my crucifix along just in case. Please do not attempt to do this challenge. We are professionals. I feel like I am protected even though I've had some crazy stuff happen to me. Please do not try this challenge. It is very dangerous and you could put people around you at risk. We're running a little bit behind schedule. It is 3.08 in the morning and we have to do this right away before we run out of haunted time. They did say that this doll had spirits already tied to it. So we're gonna see if we can attach some more spirits to it. There's something that you have to do at the end to make this be 100% legit. And that's with the water, the salt water. And I've seen a lot of these videos where they're not doing that correctly. So let's go ahead and fill them up there. A lot of people have been using blood and nails. People don't know that we have DNA in a lot of things. We have DNA in our spit. We have DNA in our hair. A lot of DNA in our hair. So we're gonna go ahead and cut a piece of our hair. Okay, that's all you need. Right there, is that good? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay, never mind. I was gonna give you a little patch. All right, got some Dylan DNA right there. Right, let's get a big chunk right there. Not a big chunk. No, not a no. big chunk. No. Just hold it. Okay. Okay. What did you take? Sorry. All right. I'm just throwing it out there. I am not a professional. So we're gonna finish it up. We're gonna play the game for real. All right. There's Thomas right there. Did you just see that move? No. I saw it. The arm just moved. No, I swear the arm just moved no, without me doing anything. Like no, you probably like shaked him. No, dude, I didn't. I didn't do anything. It, it it did like one of these. It did move down. No, it didn't. Did you get that off video? Yes. You know what? No one has ever done during one of these like one man hide and seek challenges. Actually, bathe with. The doll. That's yeah, we should totally bathe with Thomas right now. I've already went through two batteries so far making this video, and I've only recorded about three minutes of footage. Not sure if that's a coincidence or not. Okay, now we have to say that we are it. Three, two, one. Matt Omar is the it. it. You know what's kind of crazy though? That It movie's coming out. Oh, and like, it's one? a clown. Oh, yeah. And like, isn't it ironic that Thomas is a clown? He's gonna be It later. We're gonna start here in the bathroom, turning off all the lights. You guys ready? Let's do this. All right. Hey, where are we gonna hide? I'm in the closet or something. In the closet. Right here. We gotta turn this light off. Well, look, it's starting to get late, guys. 3.44. Okay, we'll leave that on. Let's hide in here. Close the door. All right, yeah. Now we have to count to 10. So let's go. Gotta do it with our eyes closed. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're here not. Here we go. I'm scared. I'm scared to break this. Not in the bathroom. Oh, that would really suck. Okay, go into the bathroom now. 
I have found you, Thomas. You are the next it, Thomas. Now we have to put him on the counter. Boy, he's heavy. Thomas looks like he's had a rough day. How's it going, Thomas? You gotta give him the knife? I have to give him the knife. Hell no. Don't give him the knife. That's what's for real? That's what you gotta do? To give him the knife. Alright. So the next thing to do now is run to our hiding spot. Run! Run! Run, 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 run! Run, 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 run! Run! Alright, we've been waiting for about 10 minutes and haven't heard anything. I'm not sure if we have to... Do we have to go out there and like start looking for it or something? Yeah. No, he's just look for us. He's supposed to look for... Oh, he's supposed to look for us. Yeah, I haven't really heard much. What the is that? What is that? What is that? What the hell? Ow! Oh! What the? What the heck? Dude! Don't even play! Was out there? Was that our cat? I don't think cat did. Yo, the TV's off. Let's go back to the door. Yo, I'm not sure if that was the doll or not, but I got cut right now. I almost got stabbed. That could have been a lot worse. The doll on the counter. Is the doll there? What the heck? Look at that big wet spot. Okay, oh, look, 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 look. Okay, 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 okay. It's a trail. Look. There's a trail. No, no, no. There's nobody here. It's hard to see the trail of water. Look, right there. You see all that water? It was wet in the kitchen, too. Thomas. Are you in here, Thomas? Thomas! Yo, wouldn't it be crazy if he was hiding in this dollhouse? Oh gosh. You in there, Thomas? Thomas! You guys see Thomas in there? Is that you guys? No. Oh, it's freaking close. Close by itself? Don't play. You got that on video? Yeah. I didn't get on video. I was recording you with that. I'm just kidding. Thomas isn't under there. Oh! Was that Thomas? I think Thomas is hard. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was Thomas. Thomas! Kitty, have you seen Thomas? Time is 419, and we have still not found Thomas. It's getting rather late. Keep looking. You got some one Dixie brand granola bar. Make sure to sponsor me. Ooh, I want one. Oh, there's one left. I almost thought I was getting clickbaited. Yummy. Oh, he might be. Thomas! What? What's wrong with the chair? Chair. Was <gasps> that you? How, how can I do that? I don't know. You said the chair. You have some tokens, I can do that. Oh my gosh, the chair's moving. The chair's moving. The chair's moving. The chair's moving. Oh! Did that really just happen? Oh my gosh. Yo, what the hell did we just do? What the hell did we just do? Oh my gosh. 
Yo, I thought my house was already kind of haunted, but I think I just made things worse. Yo. All right, there's one thing that we haven't done yet that we need to do. We got to spit salt water at it. You we got to finish this. We, we got to burn the doll. We got to burn the doll. If not, it's going to haunt us. Yo, what if he's not on that chair right now? We're oh, still there. He's still there. Oh gosh. Alright, we gotta get the salt water and spit it on him. So this is one of the steps that people seem to ignore when it comes to the one man hide and seek challenge. It's the salt water and burning the doll afterwards. If not, the spirit will stick around. These spirits are wanting to inhabit human bodies, not dolls. So this is only temporary. We have to kill the bond right now with the salt water and burning the doll. Mm. Mm. Go back to hell where you came from. Bye, Thomas. All right, fam. I just wanted to thank you so much for watching this video. A lot of creepy stuff happened tonight. It was fun. It was exciting. But at the same time, it was very, very scary. Please do not attempt to do what we did tonight. Make sure to check out my son Max's channel. He has a pretty cool channel. Also, this is my good friend Dylan. He just graduated high school. Please wish him luck. Hopefully no clowns come up in his dreams or come to haunt him with a knife, especially dolls. If you want to see some more 3 a.m. challenges, especially like the one man hide and seek, I have something up my sleeve that I might do tomorrow night. Let me know in the comments if you want to see that. I'm going to do something completely different and it's going to be really, really scary. I want to know if you want to see it. Let me know. Plus, I got some awesome overnight videos coming your way at some haunted locations that I filmed in Nevada and California. Those will be coming shortly too. Thank you so much for watching. Before you leave though, give me a kiss.